Welcome back to our How To Series Guide. In this video, you will learn how conditional logic works. Our example today would be, if a customer wants to engrave on their necklace, a custom text box will be revealed to enter their details. Let's get started by adding a new custom engraving element with yes, no values. Next, click add new element. I will choose a text area element and name it engraving details. Tick on the conditional logic options. Now choose the custom engraving option is equal to yes. Let's check how this works on the product page. The custom details text box appears when I select yes in the custom engraving field and disappears when I choose no. Thank you for watching.